Hello everyone, I'm George from Pageant Empress and today was the preliminary competition of Miss Grand International 2023 where all the delegates performed in both the evening gown and the swimsuit competition. The stage was spectacular with the excellent camera work and the creative LED screen on the background. Everyone looked so stunning and beautiful with the Vietnamese team did a phenomenal job with the hair and makeup. I also really enjoyed the heavy wind. It definitely added a dramatic effect, especially in the evening gown competition. The graceful and the soft, elegant fabric movement in the background looked really beautiful and also dramatic. So I thought that was perfect for the Miss Grand International pageant. It was really difficult for me to select my top 20 as I have been taking notes since day one as they arrived in Vietnam and they have been competing in different challenges until today. As Mr. Namat always says, he's looking for a winner who has four Bs, beauty, brain, body, and business. I'm looking for someone who can promote the Miss Grand International brand and they will help this company promote more further in the country and the region that they are from. My top 20 final prediction of Miss Grand International 2023 Miss Grand United Kingdom, Chloe Baker is 23 years old, marketing manager, Ringel and a model. She has first class honours degree in interior architecture and design from the University of Portsmouth, UK. As she has a dance background, her run representation was elegant and graceful. I noticed the Team UK has been doing an excellent job of creating social media content for Chloe. I enjoyed the creative videos of her promoting different cities of Vietnam where she has travelled from Hanoi to Ho Chi Minh City. Miss Grand Spain, Cecilia Sevilla, is 22 years old and currently studying a double degree in law and international relations. She has been working hard to prepare for this pageant as she has travelled to Thailand to improve her stage presence. Her tan skin makes her eyes stand out and her evening gown really suits her. I thought it was beautiful, I love the colour and also the intricate details of the evening gown made her shine in the preliminary competition. Miss Grand India, Ashina Subal, is 24 years old from Rajasthan. She holds a bachelor's degree in computer applications and she has a sweet and charming personality. I noticed her during the Facebook live stream during the lunch and dinner events as she has been caring and looking after other contestants as it shows her empathy and humble attitude. During today's event, she shined in her beautiful evening gown. I thought she looked like a princess. I really like this hair and makeup on her. So I hope she does this for the final event as well as I do think India has a potential to place even further than top 20. Miss Grand Uzbekistan, Amelia Shakirova, is 28 years old fashion model who has been working as a professional model in Manila, Philippines, where she had prepared for Miss Grand International pageant. She has a tall height and a beautiful Eurasian look, which is commercial and perfect for selling products, which is good as this year the business side of the pageant is very important. I enjoyed her fun and outgoing personality during the rehearsals and while traveling to different cities around Vietnam. I think she has a really cool personality that you could be friends with and if I meet her in person, I think we'll be really good friends, so I like her. Miss Grand Venezuela Valentina Martinez is 23 years old who is currently studying a systems engineering student at the St. Mary University in Barcelona, Spain. Valentina was crowned last year in August. She had over one year to improve and enhance herself to be the best version of herself before she flew to Vietnam. She has a bubbly and charismatic personality as she shined during the Best in Audi Challenge. The top six had a talk with Mr. Nawat. She let her hair down and she was free and open which made her likeable and relatable to many people. Her evening gown was beautiful today, it had a lot of gold element and I think she did a really good job of carrying this evening gown despite all the windy challenges which was really difficult because I know the wind really made it quite hard to walk in the runway today but I think she did a really great job of handling the pressure. Miss Grand Angola Eugenia Neves is 24 years old, mechatronics engineer who is currently working as an administrative assistant. Miss Grand Angola has always been the show starter in every round and she has done a fabulous performance with high energy and momentum. She has the strongest run representation among African delegates and I want to see her place in the top 20 semi-finalists so we could see this amazing performance in the final event. I really liked her unique evening gown as I did not see many contestants wearing similar outfit as she did today and for the final event I would like her to wear a bright vibrant color maybe orange or yellow evening gown that suits and complements her dark skin tone. Miss Grand Ghana Kitwana Amakwa is Ghanaian Thai Cambodian beauty who grew up near the Thai Cambodia border in a Sisakit province in Thailand. 
Growing up in a poor household, she lacked educational opportunities and it was difficult for her to further education. This has inspired her to advocate for quality education for children. She has graduated with a fashion design degree and works as a fashion designer. She's one of the top five Grand Voice finalists and her voice is mesmerizing, calm and perfect to sing a musical concert. She has a commanding stage presence with a beautiful and angelic voice. I think she will win the Grand Voice title and get a spot in the top 20 semi-finalist. Miss Grand Philippines Nikki De Moura is 19 years old Brazilian Filipino model born and raised in Brazil. She moved to the Philippines in 2016 to pursue a modeling career. She finished first runner-up in Supermodel Me reality TV show where she showed her modeling skills. Her youthful and glowing beauty makes her radiant on the stage and today she was shining in her beautiful pink evening gown and her curly hair. I think this is the styling that she should go for as even though she's one of the youngest contestants, she's mature and she knows how to carry herself with professionalism. Miss Grand Thailand, Om is 27 years old from Champon in southern Thailand. Not a new to the pageantry world as she has previously finished third runner-up in Miss Grand Thailand and competed in Miss United Continents 2017 where she placed third runner-up. Her cute and playful personality and sexy look has made her popular among the Vietnamese fans. She has a good stage presence and I really like her evening gown. It was similar to her national pageant but in different colour. I want her to be elegant for the upcoming final event as I think she was being a little bit too sexy today. Miss Grand Puerto Rico, Maria Cristina Ramos is 26 years of age and graduated with a bachelor's degree in marketing and public relations. She has a beautiful and sophisticated presence on the stage. Her red hair makes her stand out and her captivating aura during the preliminary competition was definitely noticeable. I think she was definitely a standout in this year's competition and I hope to see her improve more and look even more beautiful for the final event. Miss Grand United States of America, Stephanie Miranda is 29 years old who was born in Puerto Rico and moved to Ohio in the USA. She finished a degree in communications, journalism and theater from the Youngstown State University. A pageant veteran who has many titles under her belt, including Miss Latino America 2018, Miss Ohio USA 2020, Miss USA 2020 Top 16 semi-finalist, Miss Universe Puerto Rico Top 5, and Nostra Belleza Puerto Rico runner-up, and Miss Grand USA. I love her communication skills during the close to interview and her eyes sparkle every time she speaks with confidence and her journalism background has made her one of the best speakers in this his contest. I want to see Stephanie with her hair down as it adds character and makes her unique from the group. Miss Grand Vietnam, Lee Hong is 27 years old, graduated with honours from Ho Chi Minh City and works as an architecture and a CEO of an architecture company. As the host delegate, she has done a brilliant job at helping other contestants understand more about the Vietnamese culture, food and history. She has a good runway model presence and she has been shining in different challenges. I think she'll make it to the top 10 finalist and I really love her gold evening gown that she wore today. I think it was beautiful, graceful and elegant and I want her to wear the same evening gown for the final event as it matches her character and she looks fabulous in the evening gown. Miss Grand Dominican Republic is 21 years of age and stands at 180 centimeters tall. A biology student and a fashion model living in New York City, she was one of my early favorites when she was crowned as Miss Grand Dominican Republic because of her tall, towering height and commanding stage presence. She's a warrior who overcomes every challenge and I loved her evening gown performance today I think she looked spectacular with the dramatic cape. Miss Grand Netherlands, Melissa Botama is 23 years old, model and gymnastic coach. She has a social work degree and likes helping the underprivileged people. She's flexible and due to her dance background, she can perform with high energy on the stage. I love her personality as she's so soft-spoken but so regal and elegant at the same time. I think she is the strongest stage presentation among the European delegates and I want her to have this straight long black hair for the final event as it was so fierce, sexy and confident. I really like her evening gown performance. I thought red was a brilliant colour for her. It makes her stand out. It's such a powerful statement on the stage and I think she did great in both evening gown and the swimsuit competition. So I'm excited to see what she's going to bring on the final competition because at the moment she's doing an amazing job. Miss Grand Czech Republic, Sofia Osako is 19 years old Czech Japanese beauty who is currently studying political science and volunteers at charities. Her cute and adorable European and Asian features are perfect to promote the beauty products and I see a bright modeling and acting future in Asia. 
Sophia can sing and perform which is suitable for the music concert for the top 10 finalists, which will happen after the final competition. I think she looks so beautiful and angelic like a princess today in the soft pastel evening gown. The gown reminded me so much of Miss Grand Thailand's winning evening gown that she wore for the national passion. In terms of her presentation, I think less is more for her as she's such a cute, beautiful girl. So I think if she doesn't do too much dramatic hand movement and poses, I think that will make her look much more calm and collective. So just less of the big hand movement and more of an elegant, graceful walk on the stage. I think that will really work for her. Okay, here are my top five finalists. Starting with the fourth runner-up, I have Miss Grand Indonesia. Ritasha Wellgrade is 22 years of old, graduate summa cum laude, major in accounting. Her advocacy is about helping the elderly people to make a difference in a community. I love her bright smile and outgoing attitude as she has been so helpful of other grand sisters. She has empathy and humble personality, which is great attributes to work for the Miss Grand International Organization. I think she has the best runway presentation among the Asian delegates, and I can see her reach the top five question and answer round. Can we take this moment to appreciate her beautiful and stunning she looked today in her silver evening gown i thought it was such an incredible iconic moment and i just want to say it was amazing i loved it it was one of my favorite evening gowns from today so i hope she wears this for the final event as well third runner-up miss grand ukraine yulia kelimenko is 19 years old beauty who wants to spread the message of peace and harmony which is exactly what the world needs right now. She has a cute and angelic and charming beauty while promoting the Vietnamese sponsored products as she has been doing a great job of being an ambassador for the Miss Grand International brand and organization. If she wins the golden crown, I think this will be a great message to the world that Ukrainian women are empowered, confident and independent and they can do anything that they want to. So I think this will be a great example to show the world that we need unity, peace and harmony. Second runner-up, Miss Grand Myanmar. Nini Lin In is 22 years old, who studied civil engineering from Singapore. Her stunning Asian features, impeccable personality, and her drive to be the first Burmese woman to wear the Miss Grand International crown is admirable. I like her dedication of learning Thai and English languages in a short period of time, and that has made her a fan favorite among both the Burmese and the international fans. She's on the right direction as I think Myanmar has a chance to win the golden crown if she improves her runway walk as sometimes her swimsuit presentation was quite stiff and she needs to be much more comfortable. First runner-up, Miss Grand Colombia. Maria Alexandra Lopez is 29 years old industrial engineering graduate who has joined many beauty pageants which has helped her to be more confident in herself. After losing her father, she was in a low part of her life and Miss Grand International has helped her to overcome her obstacles and be her own superhero. I appreciate her hard work and constantly giving her best in every single challenge throughout Miss Grand International 2023. I think she'll be a great addition to the Miss Grand International family as she's always ready to work. I think Mr. Nawat likes her because of her never giving up attitude, professionalism and her dedication to the Miss Grand International organization. My winner for Miss Grand International 2023 goes to Miss Grand Peru. Luciano Festa is 24 years old, radio presenter, television figure, businesswoman, influencer with studies in communication science and marketing. She has incredible communication skills both in Spanish and English with a breathtaking stage presence. I noticed her as she's always fun and smiling during the live stream, full of energy and life. I think she is a full package as she fulfills the four B's, beauty, body, brain and business. She can use a previous experience of working on television to promote the Miss Grand International pageant to a bigger audience. Overall, I think Miss Grand Peru is the best delegate who is most qualified to be crowned as the new winner of Miss Grand International. And I'm excited to see her performance on the final event as she did a fabulous presentation today in a red evening gown with so much drama in her cape. And I thought she looked beautiful and stunning. And I'm hoping that we got to see much more of the same energy on the final competition. This is my top 20 final prediction of Miss Grand International 2023. Let me know in the comment section who do you think will be the winner of the golden crown. If you enjoyed watching this video then make sure to click the like button and click the red subscribe button to see more videos like this as it will help me grow my YouTube channel.
Let's connect on social media at the rate pageant and press on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok, and go to www.pageantandpress.com to get the latest pageant news and updates. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope to see you guys once again in my next video.